I am Anil Kumar and in this video we will try to find derivative of the function secant to the power of 4 2 pi x. Now let me begin from the very basics to get this derivative. As you know secant x could be written as 1 over cos x correct or you could say cos x to the power of minus 1 for example right. Now what is the derivative of secant x? Let's say if y equals to secant x, then dy dx is equals to, we can say minus of cos x to the power of minus 2 times derivative of inside function. So cos x derivative is minus sin x. Do you get an idea, right? So we could rewrite this as this is minus and minus makes it plus. So we get sine x and cos to the power of minus 2. Better way to write is of course cos square x. Is it okay? I purposely wrote like this so that it becomes very clear to you how power rule has been applied to get this right. Now so it is sine x over cos x. Let's go further. We prefer to write this as uh, you could look at it as a combination of sin x over cos x times 1 over cos x, correct? So that is tan x and 1 over cos x is secant x. So the derivative of secant x is tan x secant x. Is it okay? So that was just the derivation of derivative of secant x. Now let's begin to solve this. So let's say y is equals to secant to the power of 4 2 pi x. So dy dx. We'll apply the power rule, correct? We want to find derivative of this. Power rule will means 4 times secant cube, right? 2 pi x. Now, times the derivative of d dx of the inside function, which is secant 2 pi x. Is it okay? Right. So that gives us 4 secant cube 2 pi x. Now, derivative of secant x is tan x secant, secant x, right? So let me write this as tan x, x is 2 pi x, right, times secant x, I mean, I should have written 2 pi x, correct, times derivative of inside function, right, times d dx of 2 pi x, the inside function, so you are applying the chain rule here, perfect, now that gives us secant cube and secant will give to the power of 4, so we get 4, secant to the power of 4, 2 pi x times tan 2 pi x times derivative of 2 pi x is 2 pi, right? 2 pi x is 2 pi. So, multiplying 2 pi by 4 gives us 8 pi secant to the power of 4, 2 pi x times tan 2 pi x. Is it okay? So that is how you get the derivative of secant to the power of 4 to pi x. I'm Anil Kumar and I hope that helps. So we have used power rule, chain rule in this particular example. If you like, you can put some likes. Feel free to subscribe and share my videos. Thank you.